Working for McLaren was my dream job when I joined in 2012. My first role was as a design engineer working on the McLaren P1. It's such an important, iconic car in McLaren's history. Its hybrid system was really pioneering at the time, and its performance is still next level. It isn't a supercar. It's a hypercar. The key was the way we combined the turbocharged engine with an instant response of an electric motor. Petrol engines take time to get up to maximum torque, but an electric motor is like a light switch. It provides instant acceleration. We call it torque fill, when an electric motor gives the petrol engine an instant boost. Now, 10 years on, we've brought the same concept to the new Artura. I've driven the P1 a lot, and it's amazing how close the Artura is to hypercar performance. You can really feel the torque fill working in the Artura. The key is the weight. Because of its carbon chassis, the Artura weighs less than 1,500 kilos, and you can really feel it. It's so agile and balanced. The way it accelerates out of slow corners is just incredible. This combination of the lightweight and the electric motor that gives it that instant response. This isn't some box ticking exercise. Our use of hybrid technology was a choice because we wanted to create the most engaging, high performance supercar we could. The Taurus battery is 150% more energy dense than the P1. The biggest step forward is the Axial Flux electric motor. It's about the size of a dinner plate and it has twice the power density. Combining this hybrid system with the Turbo V6 brings the Artura much closer to Formula 1 technology. The P1 was ahead of its time, but the Artura really is next generation.